And joining us now is NBC News science contributor Dr. Joseph Fair. He specializes in emerging diseases. Dr. Fair, thanks for being here this evening. Absolutely. So this update from Pfizer sounds like promising news. Are you convinced, though, this is the breakthrough we need? I mean, you know, we need all the breakthroughs, all the breakthroughs that we can get uh, with regard to COVID-19, especially in the realms of diagnostics, vaccines, and therapeutics. And so, this is great news from Pfizer. You really, they, you know, the FDA probably would have approved anything over 50%, but to have two vaccines that are both at approximately 95% efficacy, uh, that is really excellent news. I think the, you know, the fact that you know we should see EUA clearance on this, uh, supposing that the FDA doesn't need any more data um, from Pfizer. We should see EUA clearance from this very soon and very, very shortly thereafter start seeing this vaccine going into, say, frontline healthcare workers and other priority personnel. EUA, that's the emergency use authorization, right? So I also want to ask you about this. Yes, at that's home. correct. Yeah. What about the at-home COVID-19 test? The FDA just gave emergency youth use authorization, the nasal swab. We understand it gives results within a half yeah. hour. It's approved for people whose doctors suspect yeah. they have the virus, right? And it's by prescription only. Is this the kind of increased testing that yeah. we need to get through this latest surge, do you think? It absolutely is. And, you know, the more tests that we can get out there, the faster they are, the more accurate they are, the easier they are to use. You know, for example, we could use it with saliva versus sticking something up our nose. That is going to, those are the kind of breakthroughs that are going to allow us to get through this combined, you know, and ultimately until we get a vaccine and get everyone vaccinated that needs to be. Just watching that video of the, so much for your insight this afternoon. Thank you.